Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo with RVs with Big Bo in Parkway RV Center. And yes, guys, you read that video title correctly. First time in months, I actually have in stock only one of these, a 2022 brand new Forest River Work and Play 21 LT crossover travel trailer. The most versatile type of travel trailer you can buy. It's brand new. And guys, I normally wouldn't be able to stock one of these, but what happened was this was custom ordered for a customer several months ago. As many of you know, it takes months to get one of these. And uh, during the months it took for Forest River to build this, some personal uh, problems happened and uh, the people were not able to complete the purchase. So we've got it here today. Brand new 2022 work and play 21 LT has a slide out. Total length is 27 feet, five inches. This thing is loaded with options. Got the second AC, the 50 amp electrical service, got the back porch kit and much, much more. We're gonna look it over today. We're gonna review it. I'm gonna show you why I think a crossover is the best uh, type of trailer that you can buy if you like, if you don't want to be stuck in a trailer that serves only one purpose. This is one that can do multiple things, kind of like the Swiss Army knife of travel trailers. And we'll look here in the front, guys. You've got a power tongue jack. Um, you've got a rack here, which you can put you a portable inverter generator if you want to. You got your spare tire, double propane bottles. Uh, this unit does have the PVC Tough Flex roof system with a 20 year, not two year, 20 year warranty. And guys, um, double axle, nitrogen filled tires. Drive weight of this camper is 5,690 pounds. Has a very impressive cargo carrying capacity of 3,985. It's got stabilizer jacks. This is what I love about crossovers right here, guys. This is such a cool concept. And this can be a ramp door too for loading toys in and out if you want to use it as a toy hauler. But you don't have to, guys. This back porch kit, great if you've got kids. Uh, great if you've got animals, get some fresh air. Put your barbecue grill out here. You've got some removable steps that go right here. You've got LED lighting. You've got a, slot, a door right here to close it off if you want to. It's got the coated basically the same thing you put on a spray-in bed liner material for traction on the outside of course this is all asdale panels too guys so no delamination problems uh this sets up very easily this is lippard's new lock-in system traditionally with the back porch kit every you had to fold everything down a certain way it's kind of a pain in the butt to set up this thing only takes a few seconds basically it's on wheels you unhook it, hook it here. You got four different places to unhook it. Everything just rolls inside and stores flat right here inside the ramp door. So this is a whole lot easier to set up and down than the older ones were. Got a power awning, LED light strips. Twenty-one LT. This is actually the smallest work and play they build currently. One key, of course, opens everything. Um, let's look inside. And inside, guys, you're going to see the rubberized flooring throughout most of the camper, which is very easy to keep clean. You've got multiple tie-down straps. So, like I said, this is a variety. This can serve a variety of purposes. This can be a toy hauler, a crossover. It can be a family camper, a couples camper. It can be a storage building. I mean, a hobby room. You can do so many things with this thing, guys. You've got double sofas. I've got one folded up against the wall, so you can see how it folds up flat against the wall, and I've got one set up. These both make separate beds. It does have a table underneath the bed that sets up in between these sofas for eating. You've got the two Euro-style recliners that you can remove very easily if you need the extra cargo space, or if you don't, extra place to sit. Let's see the 85 inch ceiling height so you can load some taller toys in here if you want to i love this part this is really cool guys 
very stable out here too I mean, you, you could put four or five people out here, no problem. Put your grill out here. If you didn't want to put it under your awning, put you some chairs out here. Really neat. LED lights. Fantastic vent fan in case you're boondock camping or you just want to circulate some air. Kitchen, thermal full uh, countertops. You've got stove top, oven, Three burner stove top, got, got the cast iron grates, LED accent lights. Look up here, you got a high point microwave. You've got the 10 cubic foot, 12 volt RV refrigerator. 12 volt, so you've always got power for your refrigerator because this can actually run off your battery when camping. If you're boondock camping, you can run it off your battery um you can uh at the campground of course you're hooked into 110 so your converter is charging your battery no problem there you've also can if you didn't need to run your air conditioner you just want to keep your batteries charged in your fridge on your boondock camping get you one of those little lightweight quiet ultra quiet inverter generators um keep your batteries charged you got a 32 inch tv of course you've got uh, Jensen stereo system, got the USB and HDMI hookups, multiple uh, USB chargers throughout the RV. Of course, there's your starter kit included. Got the decorative backsplash. Very comfortable, very cozy camper. This garage bay from this wall right here to the back of the garage door is 13 and a half feet long. Um, got a great sounding stereo system got a queen bed in the front neat camper guys and it wouldn't surprise me if this was the only 21 LT in stock in the United States right now usually you got to wait three or four months to get one of these once you order it. this one's available as of today but guys this thing will probably be gone by the end of the day there's so many work and play shoppers out there and none of them for sale of course that's new rv sales to 2021 all right you've got a split front bathroom and bedroom this is a queen island bed in the slide out i like those accent lights over there ain't that cool um and up here too you've got the optional second ac so it's got the eskimo package if you like to keep it ice cold in here one is more than enough, but you've got that optional 13,500 uh, BTU air conditioner, as well as a 15,000 that's the main one. More USB chargers, a little bit of storage right here. I mean, even, that's a big little hidden closet right there. Solid sliding door for privacy on both entry doors. You can step in here and go to the bathroom nice stand-up shower thanks to that extra tall ceiling you don't have a skylight you don't need it that's one less issue you got to worry about when it gets several years old got the rv toilet medicine cabinet cool big camper i mean it's, it's a decent sized bathroom and bedroom too and you've got the rubberized flooring in the main part of the camper and then you've got the, the uh flooring in here too that's very easy to keep clean no carpet like i said really cool guys got the nice water fixtures i mean i know working plays are built different than they used to be but they're still one of the top toy haulers you can buy or crossover campers you can buy today i mean this is something that'll last you a long time guys um and guys i'm not going to discuss the price on this video well, I wasn't going to, but I'm going to anyway. They asked me not to, Forest River did, because they get mad at us because we price these things for under map pricing because I don't have to get rich on every one of these like the big RV dealers do. I don't have mortgages and floor plans and overhead like they have, so I can sell these for a lot less. Um, I wasn't going to, but what the heck. What are they going to do? Um, MSRP on this one. I'm going to go over the options. Go over the pricing. Um, 
the 50 amp service with the second AC prep was 543. Second AC, which is actually a 15,000 BTU, not a 13.5. $862. Ramp door patio kit, which is, I think, every crossover owner should have. $1,812.50. Uh, 12 volt. T the 10 cubic foot 12 volt fridge that's standard equipment now because i can't get the parts to get the two-way rv refrigerators exterior value package 1740 um four thousand dollars uh, or excuse me forty thousand sixty dollars for the exterior value package powder coat chassis fiberglass front cap with rock guard pvc tough flex roof dexter axles i mean everything in this thing's heavy duty um the interior package led lighting steel reinforced tie downs. It's a 102 inch wide body, so it's a full eight foot wide inside. Thermal full countertops, all that stuff. Anyway, suggested retail price MSRP is $47,501.50 because it's got $9,903 in option. This has got a lot more stuff than I would normally order for 21 LT, but this was a custom order. So um, our price, and guys, I'll get in trouble for this. 33.9. Now, guys, let me go ahead and make a quick disclosure about that price. Forest River prices are going up every single month, sometimes thousands of dollars in some cases. If you came in here and ordered this exact same camper, say this one was sold, you wanted to order it, and it took three or four months to build it, chances are you're going to pay thousands of dollars more, even at our prices, because it's going to cost me more to buy this thing. But 33.9 is the price on this one as of today. Now, three months from now, if you order this same camper, it might be 36.9 or 37.9. Uh, I hope I hope it'll be less, but more likely it'll be more. And that's just the nature of used of, of new RVs right now, guys. They're going up every single month. MSRP is probably went. The MSRP on this one went up four thousand dollars from the day that this was custom ordered for the people to the day it was built it went up four thousand dollars my dealer cost went up four grand so keep that in mind guys when you order new rvs now you pay the price it is when it's built not when it's ordered that's that's something all rv manufacturers are doing it sucks it sucks for us it sucks for you but guys that's 2021 pandemic rv sales for you but this one right here locked in today for 33.9 probably not going to be able to buy another one like this again for this price ever in a brand new one 33.9 and, and the prices are only going one direction and that's up so if you are lucky enough to call on this thing and this is what you're looking for you're lucky enough to call on it and somebody else hasn't beaten you to it leave a immediate deposit on it your only other option is to wait three or, is to order one like this, wait three or four months, and spend thousands of dollars more, even here, because prices go up. If I get an email every month from Forest River. We had a, a $800 price increase, a $1,200 price increase, $1,500 because of material costs and labor costs, guys. And it, and you got to realize, guys, it is a mess right now in the new rv industry that's why we primarily sell used but i do carry a couple of brands and new ones because it allows me to um get financing on used rvs for my customers because believe it or not guys a lot of these nationwide banks will not do business with an independent dealer that doesn't have at least one or two new lines and that's why i don't have to get rich on this thing guys i got over thirty thousand dollars in it by the time i got it here i'm not getting rich off this thing by no means I'm making right at 10%, and I don't charge any fees. I don't have any upsells. Here's the thing, guys. You go to another new work and play dealer. Um, here's what happens. They're going to find. They're going to want you to finance. They don't want you to pay cash. They charge you more for cash than finance. A lot of them do, because what they do is they take the financing, they mark the interest rate up, and on a new RV, you can finance up with good credit. You can finance close to MSRP. So what they're doing is here comes the, because they know they can get so much financed on it, here comes the upsells and the interest rate markup. They'll get you approved at a low rate, but they'll mark it up two or 3%. And the banks let them keep about 75, 80% of that profit on the interest rate markup. And, um, and you're overpaying by thousands of dollars over the life of an RV loan. But that's not the end of it. New RV dealers also bring on the upsells. They imply, oh, you got to buy this extended service contract. You got to buy this extended warranty. You got to buy 
this uh, uh, gap insurance and in, oh we got to put this this stuff on the outside of it this xylon or, or ceramic or whatever it is that they spray on the outside that gives you an extra warranty for the exterior it doesn't guys it gives you a warranty but all that warranty says is it will if your camper starts fading that they'll just reapply that stuff that didn't protect it to begin with so it's it's a scam and all that stuff all those upsells are marked up three or four times dealer cost added to your rv loan with a marked up interest rate and they're making a killing in other words guys you go in one like this that's priced for 33.9 you call the bank the next day you owe 50 grand on it or four or 47 whatever the msrp is guys they really put you through the cleaner here guys we're easy simple and done 33.9 plus applicable sales tax. That's it. Not plus this, 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 and this. 33.9 plus applicable sales tax. If you're paying cash, you're coming from out of state, you pay 33.9 out the door. I can't be any more simple than that. Obviously, this is a haggle-free firm price because right now, when you work in plays, when you order them, you're, you're, you'll be lucky to get 5, 10% off MSRP. Guys, I've got this. How much is that under MSRP? Um, 47.5 was MSRP, I think. 47.5, 33.9. Put a pencil to that. What is that? Uh, <coughs> 13, 13, uh, about 13, 601, 98 off the top of my head. Or 13, 601.50. You know, I don't have a calculator. I'm trying to figure it in my head. $13,601 off of MSRP. Guys, only at Parkway RV Center. You cannot beat these prices. Plus, I have it in stock today. But like I said, it will probably be sold by the end of the day. So pick up the phone, call, leave a deposit. It's brand new. You get the full Forest River factory warranty. I think it's one year. Pretty much bumper to bumper. And, and, the, and the salespeople can go over the rest of the warranties. I know the ceiling is a 20-year pvc with a 20-year warranty so i doubt you're going to keep this thing 20 years but if you're going to this would be a good one to do it uh you can sleep six in here if you want to you can use it for it's just so versatile let me know in the comments what you think about crossovers i think crossovers are the way to go in a travel trailer because you can just do so many things with them that back porch uh the extra sleeping the extra storage you know, you can use the back half of this as a cargo trailer, use the front as living quarters. You know, if you're in the flea market, stuff like that, you can live, stay in the front all weekend and keep your stuff locked up in the back. I mean, so many things you can do with this. And it's something that most half-ton trucks can tow, no problem. So uh, anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Feel free to I don't get to do new ones very often, guys. I'm not normally a new RV fan, but when you can sell one, but when you can sell a a, a new one for less than a used price, you're doing pretty good. Um, I can't get these every day. I mean, this is it may be months before I get another one of these in stock. So anyway, guys, smash me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share on social media. Like I said, you uh, from this point on, you'll never be able to find another 21 LT loaded with these same options. For any less than this than it is today they're going to go up every day from now on so keep that in mind once it's sold it's sold and if you order one which we're happy to custom order you one but keep in mind guys we won't we can make an estimate on the cost but we won't know till it gets built and um what the actual cost and price will be but um like i said i've got this one for 33.9 where else in 2021 can you buy a brand new camper that far under MSRP? Nowhere. And then not have to pay the fees and stuff. Yeah, I could yeah, I could advertise this thing for a lower price and charge you fees, but it all comes out to be the same. So anyway, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. There's only one of these again, so call right now, 706-965-7929. Any of my salespeople can help you. Call during business hours because... If you call after hours, our call service picks it up. They send out the messages in form of emails to our employees, to our salespeople. Problem is, everybody else calls when we open and they don't get checked. A lot of times they don't get a chance to check the emails till around lunchtime. So 
keep that in mind. Call before email. Uh, our, our hours are Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern, Saturday, 9 to 5, closed Sunday for the Lord's Day and Family Day for our employees. Uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, really enjoyed this one. It's really cool. I love all the options in here. You know, if I was going to go back to a travel trailer, this style would be it for me. So anyway, guys, thank you so because I like outside anyway. I, I like bringing the outdoors in. That back porch kit does that. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Appreciate it. And uh, comment, share on social media. Feel free to subscribe. Uh, call us if you want us to get you a quote on a new work and play. We'll do our best to give you a guesstimated quote. I guarantee you this, guys, it'll be lower than anybody else's. Thank you again for watching. Look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia.